I played a game for Norway against Azerbaijan. I scored two decent goals, to be fair. But the scout was watching Ronnie Onsen. Yeah, yeah. So it was one of these lucky, lucky ones, and he rang the gaffer to say, "We've got a young boy here. I think we've got nothing to lose." And I went over to uh, to Old Trafford, flew over, uh, had lunch with uh, Sir Alex in at Old Trafford, fish and chips. I think we had actually. <laughs> Seriously? Yeah, it was. Uh, it's one of them talks that he was. He was just talking about um, first six months in the reserves, plenty of time. I said, "Yeah, straight away." I love the fact that your first meeting with Sir Alex was over some cod and chips. <laughs> I think it was, actually. Was. Very nervous going into the training ground. Nicky Butts, the first one I meet, and yeah. he's like, oh, welcome, and I'll take you down to the dressing room. And you soon realise these are normal boys, but yeah. just better at football than the, the, the normal yeah. average uh, guy. And I was, I'd practised my French to say when I was going to say hi to Eric, because yeah, yeah. Eric obviously was, uh, he was a bit nervous and he was late that day and so he was just came running onto the session after we'd started so yeah. I never managed to do a proper um, uh, introduction but I think he accepted me there and then because I had a decent training session to be fair. Maybe he was late because he was practicing his Norwegian to say hello yeah, to you. You never know, you might have heard about me, you never know, but we, you never we, know. we bonded really well, me yeah. and Eric, and the last thing we did together as Man United uh, players was a party uh, after we won the league. He'd rented a restaurant, me, Jordi and Eric, and our family's girlfriends, and he never ever mentioned that he was going to leave. So we said, hi, see you later. Me and Jordi went down to London next day, and we listened to the radio that Eric Cantona has retired. He never even mentioned it. So we were partying until four o'clock in the morning, dancing, and <laughs> that's, that's Eric for you. Yeah, and I'm done. See you later. <laughs> yeah. Blackburn. So I came, uh, came on for about 10 minutes or something at the end because we were trailing. I think we needed to uh, get some goals. Did you score in that game? Yes, I did. I scored. Flick on by. I think Jordi, Jordi Croy flicked it on. Volley, not the best of volleys to be fair. Rebound yeah. by Tim Flowers and the rebound again, then uh, another volley and I scored. Uh, six minutes after I came on, turn around, he was the first one celebrating, that's Eric Cantona. And then suddenly, wow, it's, uh, that, that was a surreal moment. When you got the shout from the gaffer, yeah. were you just like, <laughs> just like. No, no, no. I'm, if there's one thing, one place I feel at home, it's on the pitch. Yeah. I'm not nervous whatsoever, looking forward to it. Just Even though it was your debut? Yeah, but I know I can score goals. I still do, <laughs> to <Yeah>. be fair. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, but that was my strength. Uh, for me, there was no one better to, um, to kick a ball, as, get rid of a ball as quick as you can, but in the net. We won the league my first season, and that's the first thing I've won as a, as a player, and that was unbelievable. And when you get the taste for it, you just want more. Right. It can go both ways. I've seen players winning and then see you later. Yeah, but yeah. That was such an unbelievable feeling. The manager always made sure that we had a proper party, that you celebrate, bang, and then you get it over and done with, and then you move on. <laughs> get, get the hangover yeah. out of the way yeah. and go again. Who were the uh, party animals in that team? Oh, Who gave it a right good shot? Oh, we, had, we had a few uh, dark horses, you know. Uh, not like... They didn't go out every weekend, but when we had a party, it was a proper party. <laughs> and uh, Went large. You sat, yeah, but you've, some, some of them just ends up sitting in the corner, just um, had enough. Come on, we yeah. need some names nah, here. Gaffer, we, come on, we, come we, on. We, we can't, uh, they, they, they've said themselves, you know, Macy was always the uh, Macy, they would, life of the party, Macy, Giggsy, Nicky. Yeah. yeah and then Scolsey was the one that just went tired. <laughs> just nodded up in the corner. <laughs> Honestly, I cannot remember. Because, because you know, when I when I came, Man City were not in the Premier League. It must have been 2000, 2001. I, I don't have too many good memories of the derbies, to be fair, though, because I remember losing, I think that was the last one at Main Road, but I scored, but we lost. Yeah. I didn't score in a win. 
I actually scored against Peter Schmeichel. He should have never played for Man City anyway. He should have been <laughs> so. <laughs> oh well, uh, that's that's <laughs> another story. But um, you see, everyone's ready. You don't need a team talk before these games.